The TAL UNO62 is a polyphonic virtual analog synth with a unique filter sound. An original Roland UNO60 is used as a reference for the oscillators and filters and the great thing is that it's free. A good reason to check it out. First let me ask you to subscribe to this YouTube channel. If you subscribe we will keep you updated on all the great free software and tools we review every week. The plugin can be downloaded for Windows 32 and 64 bit and also for Mac. The download is a zip file which only holds the DLL file. This DLL needs to be copied to the folder on your computer where the VST plugins are stored. Once you have done that, you can start your DAW and place this UNO62 on screen. The plugin comes with 20 presets and of course you can make some sounds of your own. At the top right you see the DCO which stands for Digital Controlled Oscillator. There the sound is generated. It has three waveforms, a sawtooth, a square with pulse width modulation and a sub oscillator with square, which is an octave lower than the original note and it has a noise generator. The pulse width can be modulated through the envelope generator and also by the LFO. The LFO is in the middle. You can change the LFO rate and it also has a delay time and this makes the LFO kick in a bit later. The LFO can generate sine, triangle, sawtooth, square and also a random generator. And you can bypass the rate slider and set the tempo of the LFO according to the speed of your DAW. At the left you see the chorus 1 and 2, which are both stereo choruses, and one controller to control the envelope with the velocity of your MIDI keyboard. At the left of the lower part you see the sliders for the pitch wheel, it can modulate the pitch of the DCO and also the filter, the VCF. There's a high pass filter which you can use to make the sound a bit thinner, and the VCF, the voltage controlled filter, can be controlled by the LFO and also by the envelope and even reverse envelope. The next step is the VCA, the amp, which can also be controlled by the envelope. And the last section is the envelope generator itself, also known as the ADSR, attack, decay, sustain and release. Oh, the panic button is used when notes get stuck and keep on sounding. And you can also set the number of voices, which is from 1 to 6, like the original Juno 60, it is 6 voice polyphonic. Well, that's all there is to tell about this Juno 62. It's a great and easy synthesizer with some really 80s sounds. Now let's listen to some of the presets. More information and the download can be found on our website. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.